galaxies waiting to be found. Planets rich in resources. Battles to be fought. The universe you wouldn't believe. It's the most ambitious and anticipated game of 2016. No Man's Sky finally went gold in July and it hits the planet in early August. Well, for PC and PS4 gamers it will. Sorry, Xbox users. What is it? Well, it lets you explore the universe in a spaceship. That's pretty much it. The game has no narrative as such, but it took nearly four years to make. Why? 18 quintillion, 446 quadrillion, 744 trillion, 73 billion, 709 million, 551,616 planets. Maybe that's why. Players begin somewhere in this vast universe and will need to trade, combat and explore their way through space to upgrade both their avatar and spaceship to travel deeper into the centre of the galaxy. Simples. But how is it possible to run a game of this size? Well, nearly all the elements are procedurally generated, meaning everything is created algorithmically and doesn't have to be written manually into every version. And that's getting the gaming world very, very excited. Add to that, No Man's Sky was supposed to be released years ago, but issues like an office flood and a three-year legal wrangle with media's group Sky over the use of the word Sky meant the game was so delayed its developers received death threats. Still, the wait is nearly over. Now all you need to do is find a spare five billion years or so to explore the entire game. <laughs>